What's going on guys? Uh, I know I haven't made a video, a legit video in a while. Um, we'll see what happens with that. A lot of people have been asking me in person how I made uh, this, this um, Cruella Perler bead necklace. I know it's pretty nerdy of me. So here's a DIY to it. Pretty much what you need to make one of these necklaces are an iron to heat up the beads, the wax sheets, the wax perler bead sheets, Three different colors of the uh, perler beads. I uh, usually want the darkest color for the border and then two inside filler colors. Two chains from Holly, Hobby Lobby, whatever color that you want. Uh, I think these were like $3 a piece. And you need to because one w isn't long enough. Um, an iron board or a towel, whichever. Two perler boards, peg boards, and uh, the template, uh, which I'll post a link online on where you can um, uh, download the template at. Snap the boards together uh, to make one long board so they won't come apart. And then just set it there. And then just start working on the border. And these are uh, the amount of colors you need for each one. When you do this, you kind of want to work reverse. You don't want to work off the sheet like this. You kind of want to work off of it like this, like where it's backwards. Turn the sheet upside down and then just start placing on the pegboard accordingly. Okay, so this is how it came out, the border. Um, after you finish the border, you can fill in crew with uh, one color and then Ella with another. Coming along, there's the first color. And then uh, I'm gonna go ahead and start on the second set of uh, colors of the pink for Ella. And so filling in both the colors, this is what it looks like. What we have to do now is place the wax paper on top of the beads and uh, iron them down for uh, 10 second passes. After ironing the back, you're gonna wanna iron the front with the wax paper uh, not too long because you still want it to look 8-bit uh, with the holes in it. So uh, do it for like 10 seconds but don't 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 keep going over it like this. Like you do the back so you can uh, so they stay together. You do the front so they can stay together but still maintain the, uh, the holes, the 8-bit look. Alright so what you're gonna do is grab your two chains. Two chains. Gonna connect them together. Um, to get some jewelry pliers or some kind of pliers. Take off these little silver things. Again, you can get these chains from like a, a Hobby Lobby or Michael's. Um, I'm gonna use my teeth. Don't use your teeth. And you just wanna bend it out uh, with your pliers. And uh, so this will fall off. And you're gonna wanna attach it to the end of the other chain. So, like this. Bend this chain link out. And then pull out that uh, connector chain. Pull it out. And then you're gonna, like I said, connect these two. So, I'm gonna push it in back. If not too easy, you can make sure you use your teeth. Don't use your teeth. And voila. Your chain should be a long piece, and it's gonna have these uh, these spring connectors, these spring locks right there. I'm gonna put it on the fourth, like the fourth one in. So one, two, three, four. Fourth one in, and you might have to take a nail to it because uh, it might be melted from when we ironed it. But it worked well. So there's that. There's one side. Now time to do the other side. Again, the fourth one on this side. So one, two, three, four. And then just slip it through that perler bead hole. Again, like I said, you might have to put it down to it. And you're done. So you can pretty much rage all night with your new perler bead. Uh, I'm excited. This is gonna be the fourth, fifth time I've seen Cruella. I'm gonna see him tomorrow here in Austin and I'm gonna see him uh, on Sunday in 
your chain and turn it So now you can look cool with your chains, little bag through them, and then you can put on your raver glasses with the eel strips on it. Let me turn it off. I don't even know how to turn these things on. Let me turn off the light. And yeah, that's it. So uh, if you like this video, go ahead and subscribe to me. My name's Infuser. I haven't done a video in a while, but um, hopefully I can jump back on that.